Okay, so the next question is from All the Sage, and it's related to um, the video that we made called Our Greenhouse is Clad and Glazed, plus we installed the trampoline inside, which the kids are not going to use because they'll probably knock their heads off, by the way. We tried it, and it's kind of dangerous. So All the Sage asks, looks great. You said the tall back wall is going to be another solar panel. If it's facing north, how will that work? I'm assuming that the roof is oriented so that the face it's facing south to get passive solar benefit. So you'll notice that the glazing that we're looking at in the background here is facing to the south. And so the sun, when there's no snow on there, will come right through that glazing. And the solar air panel is gonna sit on that north wall, which you're right about, but the panel itself will be facing south. And so it'll pick up any solar heat coming off of, uh, or coming into that actual greenhouse itself. Now, while there's no sun getting in there, what's really cool about all that snow that's stuck on there is that it's actually creating a thermal benefit inside of the actual greenhouse itself. So it's quite warm in there right now because the snow acts as a bit of an insulation. Okay, hopefully that answered your question. Um, if you're interested more in greenhouses, uh, you may wanna check out our Passive Solar Greenhouse program. We have case study, a case study program. We also have a DIY tool uh, which shows you how to make some of the calculations and you don't have to be an engineer or a rocket scientist to use that tool It's very self-explanatory and easy. It runs on Microsoft Excel But we also have the full passive solar greenhouse course that's available on our website And I'll leave all those links in the show notes below. Thanks guys. Have, see you in the next video